Hey guys, Otto from Everything Amiibo here, and today we're going to be reviewing the Fox Amiibo. Hello and welcome to Everything Amiibo. So, as in the Pikachu review, uh, I gotta apologize in advance for my nose. I've got a pretty bad cold, so I may be sniffling, sniffling, whatever you call that, <laughs> along the way. Very, very sorry. Uh, I didn't go too badly in my Pikachu review, actually. This was, of course, done the same night, so sorry about that. Anyway, without further ado, let's start out with build quality as per usual if you watch my Amiibo reviews. So, again, similar to Pikachu and most of the other Amiibo we've had recently, um, very, very sturdy build. Very, actually. You wouldn't, this is, this is something you're only going to know from getting a review of it or your friend telling you you're getting it yourself. Fox does not look like he's going to be one of those sturdy ones, but no, no, no. He is like, you cannot move him. He's crazy sturdy, which is pretty darn amazing. Of course... A negative to that would be that he does require those uh, stand things, but I must say, and I'll talk about it again, they look pretty, pretty good actually. Um, so he also has <clears throat> pretty good weight, even though he um, he's a pretty uh, like light character in the game and looks like you'd be pretty light. He does not feel like he's gonna fall apart and has some. Just a nice feel in your hand, so that's all right. But anyway, definitely solid build quality, good little thing. So it's certainly not a negative for him. So let's move on to detail. Well, Fox has got to be the most detailed amiibo I've seen yet. He just has the craziest accuracy of detail everywhere, and the the craziest amount of accessories just absolutely everywhere. So, of course, on that note, let's take a little tour. So, there you can see his face. He's already got his, like, little eyepiece and his uh, speaker, and his headband, and it's, like, around about this area that's the most impressive. So, even his gloves are pretty detailed, but the hands are not so great. But if you go over here, just look at that jacket. He's got, I can do some pointing here. He's got like gold pins here and here. He's got that special um, pattern on his jacket. He's got a little belt buckle there. And like you can see the pocket coming out, a little black thing down there. He's got a zipper, like they properly done in the zipper with the zip at the end. Another like zipper jacket beneath it. His little shield thing that he uses is totally done properly um, again belt buckle with the uh, Star Fox logo on it there if we can get a focus yeah so on his belt buckle he has the logo on his gun holster thing he's got the logo again and come on man and he's got like his whole gun in there it's incredibly incredibly detailed it's so so nice to look at when you zoom in um when you zoom in uh i'll be talking about that again in a second so again there's this little logo gold pattern look two little buckles there it's incredible just incredible and the shoes the shoes have a really nice look to them you definitely can't tell um on camera here but wow, the shoes stand out so much. They're really, really nice. Um, so, yeah, just an absolutely astounding amount of detail. Uh, but for some reason, this is his only negative in detail besides a few minor painting errors. Um, he just, he doesn't have that same feel as, as Pikachu and Mega Man, where he just feels like he's popping out, like he's a real... Um, Fox McCloud just gonna jump out and run around. It's, it doesn't quite feel like that. It feels like a really nicely detailed toy. But but Mega Man just looks like Smash Bros. Mega Man just <laughs> grabbing his leg. Uh, like, like there. Like It just looks like real Mega Man there. Pikachu, same with him. But Fox, 
not so much. Uh, I don't know. I think it's because it lacks simplicity, which means it just it doesn't feel like a real cartoon. And then it can't feel like a real, you know, realistic thing because it's not it's still a cartoon. So, but yeah, it's it's an amazing amount of detail and really really well done. And crazy amount of accessories. Just doesn't have quite that feel of like like it's real. So, let's finish off with character. Well, of course, um, this one's a bit weird. Uh, he's one of those characters that was actually completely made up, the design, not, not the history and name of the character. I'm not that stupid. Uh, for Smash Bros. Brawl, a lot of characters had this done to them, actually. Uh, I'm going to try and think of them. Um, I guess Wario. He was a bit from maybe WarioWare or something. He was definitely spruced up for this. Pit was completely created from pretty much scratch, a couple of pixels into his own character. And Fox McCloud really got his modern Fox appearance, which has only really been used in Smash Bros, from uh, Super Smash Bros. Brawl. So that may disappoint some fans, but at this point, a lot of fans of Fox are actually Smash Bros. players who like his, you know, skill-based uh, stats and attacks in Smash Bros. But, uh, yeah, it doesn't look like the original Fox. Not really at all. <laughs> the face, sure. But it's this gritty, gritty Super Smash Bros. Brawl version. Um, and most likely, if you wanted to pair this amiibo with your Star Fox Wii U game, it, uh, it'll probably be compatible, but um, it just, you know, it wouldn't work out because it's probably going to be a far more cartoony uh, Fox in that game. So that's a bit of a shame. The pose, however, is pretty darn great. It's it's a perfect fit. They um they went for uh like a jump, uh but sort of like a, a dodge and a run at the same time, which whoops just encapsulates Fox play Fox's play in Super Smash Bros. really 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 well. It's great, you know. It just, it looks like him in action. And the bit I love the most about his pose and his face here, let's move that camera back over, is if we set him up with the Smash Bros. logo as it's supposed to be, so like this, it's the way he's supposed to be facing. Just look at that face. If we can get, if we can get a focus. <laughs> just look at him. He's like, yeah, I got this. I got this. He, he knows what's going on. He just, like, just quick glance over as he's dodging, like, I'm in charge here. I got this. Fox McCloud knows what's going on. Yeah, so it's great. I love it. Um, and just that, overall, that, uh, that amount of detail is astounding. It's genuinely, like, it's an impressive feat, even. Um, so, unfortunately, he did have to score a little lower than Pikachu because he's not quite that, he doesn't have that perfect feel. But I do love my small details, so I gave him a 9.5 out of 10. So, thank you for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe to Everything Amiibo for more Nintendo toys and games. I'll see you guys later.